Alright guys, we're back. We're back to begin episode number 22 of Yoshi's Woolly World. Since in the previous video, we just got rid of World 3-3 as expected, and we're going to now move on to World 3's Fortress now. And because of that, we're going to head into the Yoshi Hut to pick up Yellow Yoshi, since we're going to use it for this episode again, just like we did in the last two worlds. Here he is, right here. Not if you'll excuse me. Alright, well with all that out of the way, let's begin episode 22, shall we? I am ready for it. Since we completed all the other levels, onwards to World 3's Fortress. And we're going to face a familiar mini-boss that we met before because Big Montgomery is striking back. World 3-4, Big Montgomery's Bubble Fort. Yeah, I think you can tell where this episode is going. Alright, the gimmick with this fortress, bubbles. And you're going to be seeing a lot of these throughout this episode. So, yeah, hope we're not too bubble crazy with it. Alright, getting those. Getting that, thank you. Jumping that guy, getting that guy. Doing this. This. this guy, and that guy. That was completely pointless. Urgh, there we go. Getting those. Getting those as well. I got him just as soon as he came out of that bubble. As soon as he came out of that bubble, I got him. Fortress music though. And I got that guy without even trying. Well, I can't do it if those guys are going to be in the way. <laughs> that, I just realized that was not even a wall. how I'm still able to get them, but I'll take it regardless. I'll be taking those, thank you. Okay, I'm doing pretty good so far. Pretty good. I got half of the niche first stamps, so I should be able to get the last couple without any issues. Okay, again, didn't mean to do that. That was on purpose. Or at least I got those two. <laughs> Nothing can stop me, come on! <laughs> I don't know what that money one was doing, just running side to side! Thought I got hit by- never mind, I suppose! Never mind! Wait, what happened to the green one that I had? Oh, you know what? I think I think it must have been mixed in with that one orange one. I think that's what happened. Jeez, 
just relax with that. Jesus. I was going to say, if that did not have any hearts, I was really going to be mad. Okay, I want to go back down because this is way too many orange yarn balls to deal with. Way too many to handle. Not about to leave without a lot of these yarn balls. Come on, do the games with me. There we go. Track. I was trying to get it and then I couldn't get it fast enough. Alright, come on. There we go. Mm -hmm. Now I'm back to normal. All right, let's go. I'm very picky when it comes to the arm balls I want to have, man. Having one of every color is much better than just having multiple versions of the same color. At least in my eyes. You being on that bubble platform must really be unpleasant. No, oh, seriously. What am I thinking? No! supposed to get up here for a reason. Is there a bonus room in here? That why? Oh, let's get all these gems. Got that. I have to grab all the, the right ones. There we go. Got it. All right. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We'll get this guy just in case. Get rid of those two. And it looks like I made a smart decision because, looking and behold, we found that. You actually got stuck there, man. You gotta chill it with this bubble game. I'll get in a second. Right now, we need to focus on getting on top of the bubble. Ugh, I hate it. Though I think most likely it's it's just going to be hearts, but we'll see what it actually is. Let's go under here. Okay, we'll get this guy. I didn't mean to get rid of the green one I had! Well, this is a freaking waste of time. Okay, luckily they give you extra ones, so I'm not even complaining about it. I don't know where the heck these guys came from. They came from the bubbles, duh! Try this again and make sure we don't end up screwing ourselves. Not the last time I went through it. Um, nope, still not high enough to get it. <laughs> Yo, she's barely touching the bubble yet he's not jumping on it. Like, that quirk doesn't make any sense, bro. You know what? I guess I'm gonna have to sacrifice one of these. But I, I, if this is not gonna work, then I'm gonna have to sacrifice one of them. And sure enough, it's hearts. And sure enough, I was gonna get another orange one anyway. So what was even the point of complaining? There's gonna be another one of these, cuz. <laughs> I didn't mean to get rid of that one! Nah, it's gonna be no issue anyway. Oh. Yoshi, Yoshi, chill! Alright, we'll get those. 
Go get that guy. I'm gonna actually collect that piece of yarn later. Much later. Back up a little second. There we go. That's probably gonna be the last stamp. No joking about it. But first, I wanna go over here. There we go. That's the last flower. That is the last stamp. The last universe stamp. I kinda knew it. Alright, all that's left to do is just to collect that last Wonder Wolf. And I know the cheapest way of how to get it. By flying all the way over there with these wings. I know this is gonna waste a bit of time, but I don't care, okay? I'm doing it my own special way. Got it! Alright, there we go. Now we've collected everything. Alright, well, now that I've collected everything, we can finally move on as usual. Oh, pfft. screw that! We have full health! I'm not even complaining. Alright, time for our mini-boss. Though it's probably going to be the same one that we met back in episode 4. So, not even complaining. Alright, let's go. Hmm? The sale of yarn here looks familiar. Ah! It's a Yoshi! I'm tired of Yoshi's ruining my plans! Hey you, minion! I need you to stop any Yoshis from getting past here! That's what you think, Kamek. Alright! Starts our second matchup with Bib Montgomery. Now this one is a bit different comparing to the last one in that the strategy is a bit different but kind of much the same. You have to throw the yarn ball against his belly in order to flip him onto his back, of which you can then um, cause the hits to occur. It is a bit um, more difficult this time around just because he makes shockwaves this time and such like that, but you kind of get the main agenda. It's like that kind of sort of thing. Oh, just before, before we threw that last one. Arrgh! Playing Big Montgomery, come on! We'll get this guy. You may be the most threatening thing in existence, but still. That still somehow got him. I don't know how, but it did. Wait, go, 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 go! Da! Caught him at the last minute. He was gonna get up too, and I wasn't gonna give him the chance. See, strategy pays off in the end. I don't care what you people say. Okay, overall not too bad. Went a bit crazy, but we were still able to pull through it, so I'm not complaining. But just like that, World 3's Fortress is completed. A full 100% on that one. Alright. It took a little while, but we were finally able to complete World 3's Fortress. And we got a new power badge! This lets us see hidden items. Not bad, not bad. Okay! And we got Yogurt Yoshi! Don't know why he was in a bubble fortress, but okay. And as expected, this leads us to World 3-5. Alright, this may be a good stop for this episode, because I think I went through enough of that fortress. Well, that's gonna wrap things up with this video, guys. Bit Montgomery stroke back, and then we were able to beat him, so yeah. In case, we hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm glad, I'll be glad to see you guys next time when I come back for the next episode, of course. So until next time, see you guys next time.